Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm here with my latest Super Tarts haul. This was on Friday, I believe. She had done a restock. Um, it was kind of a funny story how this transpired. Um, she usually do her, does her restocks on Friday. Um, we were actually out. We had gotten our Christmas money from my in-laws and we had gone up to Tanger Outlets in Pigeon Forge to get my daughter some new Adidas shoes. That's where our closest Adidas store is. And my father-in-law got her addicted to Adidas. So I, we had gone up there and I had been scrolling Facebook. My husband always drives when we go out and I was scrolling through Facebook and somebody said the site was down. I went, oh shit, it's Friday. And I don't usually like to order when I'm not home. I like to kind of keep track of what I have so I don't buy too many of the same scent. I didn't have my list with me. <coughs> I totally flaked it. It was Friday. I don't even know what happened. So I went ahead and I thought, okay, well, I know there's a couple things I really want if she restocks. And there's a couple things I know that I, I will never have too much of if she restocks those too. I already had a few in my cart from previous because I typically will do that after I place an order, I will fill my cart again <laughs> with things that I want to try. <coughs> and then the next restock, I will grab them all at once. So I already had a few things in my cart that I wanted to try. So I did get a few new to me since I got some body care. This was probably one of my biggest single orders to date from her. <coughs> it came in a medium box and I will say something really funny about this and I'm not I'm not bashing super tarts or anything when I say this but I find it funny that if you order in a PFRE it is at your own risk that they're going to come cracked or like that either clamshells are going to be cracked or the wax is going to be cracked in the clamshells they say it's more secure in a box now I do not order very often in a box usually I order in a PFRE I've had maybe less than five clamshells come cracked in the last year that I've been buying from Super Tarts total. And I've bought hundreds, if not thousands of clams in the last year. I mean, I have, I, I have probably close to 200 clams now and I have finished a couple hundred. So I'd say three, 400 clams I've bought over the last year. I've had more clamshells or the wax in the clamshells crack in this order alone than I have in the whole entire year I've been ordering in the PFREs. That's amazing to me. And again, I'm not bashing super tarts. I'm not saying, oh, they don't pack their, sh their shit good. They was packed. Awesome. But I find it funny that the PFREs are less secure and I've had less cracks. So anyways, I'm going to jump right in. My sample that I got in this order was Holiday Latte. My husband loves this scent. I am not overly crazy about it. Um, I think Kim had mentioned that it is... I want to say Kim. I'm sorry, Kim, if, if it wasn't you. Um, that said, it is a harsh coffee. It's, you know, very bitter. And I agree. Um, but my husband likes it. So I got a bam bag because, you know, I figured, yeah, why not? So then I got some body care. Uh, Rosemary's Baby is one of my favorite scents. For those of y'all who follow me, you guys know this. I melt it all the time. I always talk about it. Um... So when she restocked body care, I thought, okay, I have to have this. So this is um, a shower gel. I love the back. It says, to use, get naked, hop in the tub or shower, and lather up. Remember, sharing is caring. Rawr. And so I'm going to be excited to use that. That would be good to use when I'm trying to wind down. And then I got a body butter in the same scent. And it's funny because we already dug into it last night. Um, it's kind of interesting because it's a butter consistency. But then when you put it on your skin, it kind of melts. Um, it reminds me of a hand salve that my mother-in-law has brought to us a few times. She works for a company that makes like massage oils. And they also make things like these kind of things and salves and stuff uh, for your hands and... Um, she brought us a salve and that is the consistency when it's on your skin that it leaves and I like it a lot. It says to use butter my butt and call me a biscuit. Best rubbed on after a bathing or before bed. Useful for more than your bum. And I love this. So that's going to be really good to use at bedtime. And I, I know y'all have noticed my hands crack so bad in the winter. And so between the sugar scrubs, that's what we use the sugar scrubs on and the, the body butter. Yeah, the butter. I'm really hoping that'll help. So onto the clamshells. Um, I got a couple new to me scents. So I'm going to jump right in with those first. This one is Christmas Vacation. And I put an ISO up. I did not want a BAM bag in case I hated it. 
Um, I'd never smelled it before, so I, I figured, well, she's going to restock clams in those scents pretty soon. So I grabbed um, some clams. It's freshly cut Christmas tree and crisp snowy spearmint. I love the design on the bottom because it's so festive. So what I do is I have these stacked. I bought a couple of the under-the-bed storage bins. They're long, narrow blast plastic bins um, from Walmart, and they are standing up like this in the bin. So if you've got them in a line like this, you can't see what these scents are underneath without pulling them up. So that's why I put these labels on. That way I can see what I have. Everybody else can see what I have and it's easier. So, um, and then I write the date I receive them on the bottom because I have so many to keep track of. It's easier for me to write the date. So this one is really, really good. I'm so glad I got, I got two of these and I'm really glad. And this one you can see is, is cracked right over there. Which again, I don't care. I'm going to melt it anyway. But I just found it funny that they claim that the PFREs are less secure. Um, and this one also is cracked up that way. Um, again, I don't care. I'm going to melt it and crack it anyway. But I just found it funny because I've never had this problem with the PFREs. Next is Dumbledore. This is another new to me scent. It's apple slices, pink chiffon, and blue cotton candy. And this one's also cracked. It's got that what phoenix is that a phoenix i don't have any idea i've never seen harry potter i am so sorry y'all are gonna hate me now <laughs> and this one i get apple slices and pink chiffon i really like it so i'm hoping on warm it's the same if not better and the last new to me scent is aunt gail and it's rain mistletoe cranberry catnip and mint and they, this is so cute look got little cat heads and that one's cracked too it's got little cat heads and this one I get cranberry, mint, rain, and maybe mistletoe. I don't even know what catnip smells like. I have five cats, and I don't even know what catnip smells like. So this is going to be a really good bathroom scent. So I am super excited to have that. I kind of wish I had gotten another one. It is in my cart um, to buy again. <laughs> um, the rest of these are, are repurchases. This one's violet, peppermint, cotton candy, blackberry. I love Tate. And so I figured I would try this one too. It's together for always. And it smells really good. I love her blackberry. And this smells really good with the peppermint. So I'm excited to try that. The next one is a favorite of mine. It's Swan. It's Blonde Moment Lemon and Pink Chiffon. This one's one of my favorites for cleaning the air after I have um, been cooking. I love the little sheriff symbol. It's so, so good. I mean, this is such a f nice fresh scent so when i've cooked beef or if i've cooked just something and the air kind of is eh i will throw this on in the evening to kind of clean it and it does work the next one is sookie i got this one with my husband in mind because it is one of his favorites it's gingerbread buttery cake bites and applesauce buttercream believe it or not my husband loves wax um, he loves the way the room smell. He is a, like, we would go to the store and he would not be able to leave without smelling all the candles. Well, now we go to the store and he wants to smell all the wax. Like we go to Walmart, we stand in the wax aisle for a half hour so he can smell the wax aisle. And it says on the verge of blubbering here. And that one's cracked too. And that smells really good. It is so creamy. Oh man. And this one <laughs> I've been looking for forever. Die Hard pin, pi, pin Needles. Pine Needles and Sugar Cookies. And <clears throat> this one is nice. It's cracked too. Um, I love the, I guess that's supposed to be blood spat. Yeah, it's blood spatter. I love that. And this is one I would probably mail all year long. Um, most of these type scents, like the Christmas Wish and the ones that have like a sugar cookie with a pine tree or a Christmas tree, you get mostly Christmas tree. This one is so even, if not a little bit more on the sugar cookie, and I love it. I melted this last year, and I swear I melted it like half the spring too. So I grabbed two of those. I really wish I had gotten more, but I wanted to be fair and not buy every single one. The next one is Darth. I love this in the bathroom. It's Omen blended with rosemary mint. I love her rosemary mint. I love Omen blends, and I love them in the bathroom especially. And I love these designs with the squigglies. And I mean, I like black wax. I just like the appearance of black. And this is so good. So spa-like. And um, that's a really good one for the bathroom. I was low on Darth, so I wanted to grab more. 
Another uh, one I was low on is Coven Cola Cake Butter Vanilla Bean Oil Zucchini Bread. And when I say low, I have a BAM bag of it, but I like to keep a clam or two also of every scent that I have. I like to keep a full clam as part of like my collection. And then like I don't want to melt that until I have another clam as a backup. It's, it's, I don't even know what I do. <laughs> I don't even understand what I do. And that one's got the blood spatter also. I love her cola. And mixed with that cake batter and zucchini bread is so good. Another repurchase is Ron Magical Delicious and Creamy Orange Sherbet. And I think I still have a partial fan bag of this. Oh, God, I love it. It's got the little rat. I think that's a rat. Yeah, it's a rat. Um, it's so, so good. I don't, like I said, I've never seen Harry Potter, so I don't even know what, who these people are. And then Toodles, Ice Lemonade, Sweet Lollipops, and Gain. I'm really starting to like Mouse Ears blends. I never used to. They used to be too strong on the, the like the lemon, it used to be just too strong and headache inducing. But I really am starting to like these Mouse Ears blends. I have a couple now. And that one is kind of pretty. It's got the polka dots and the blue and the yellow and this smells so good oh man and the last one is annabeth and it's saltwater taffy and pink sugar and this one is just so good i love this one it's got chunks and an overpour it is so pretty i like her olympian melts she was doing a lot of the ones that have these chunks and overpours and i just think it's so pretty and this is so good that pink sugar i i've i think somebody has mentioned I forget who it was. I watched so many people. I forget who says what. Um, somebody had said, I think it was Avalon. It may not be. Um, that like saltwater heavy can be kind of sour. But this one with the pink sugar, it, the pink sugar makes it sweeten. So it's not bad. I really like it. So that is my haul. Um, I just wanted to get a couple backups. Um, I was getting low on a couple things. I wanted to get some new to me scents. And I wanted to stock up on some favorites. As well as get some body care. When I saw Rosemary's Baby. I don't usually buy body care from Super Tarts. But when I saw Rosemary's Baby. I had to grab it up. So anyway. So that is my haul. I will have another one. Whenever they ship the Monday sale one. The Monday was madness. It was um, back stock. So there was. She said one to five. Of each scent. So there wasn't. It's not like she poured 20 of each scent. Something she only had one or two of. It was crazy. So, I mean, I luckily was able to get everything that I wanted. But it was crazy. And I got some more new to me scents in that order too. I'm trying to branch out and try new to me scents. Um, the worst case scenario is I hate it and then I can destash it or I can pass it on to somebody. Best case scenario, I love it. And then I'll be able to, you know, grab some more. So, I'm trying to step out of my comfort zone and try some new scents. Um, I've actually tried a couple new scents this week. Um, I tried, what was it I tried yesterday? Um, oh, President Coin was a new scent. And I thought it was going to be too overly like fruity or floral. And it was beautiful. Um, so that's another one that I want to grab another one up to have on hand. I like to have a full clam. I've said this. I like to have a full clam of each scent. And then I can work on a backup. Or I want the backup and I can work on the one I'm working on. So... I'm just, I'm kind of weird like that. I like to make sure I have enough. Um, if I like it, I have six warmers going. So if I like a scent, I could, I don't usually because I like to mix it up. I could use one clam and it's gone in one day um, because I have so many warmers going. So it's just hard to, to, to judge what I need and what I don't need. Um, ones I use in the bathroom, I don't need as much of because it's it's one warmer so it's one sometimes I can go 24 hours with one melt in the bathroom it depends on um, some super tarts I've let go for a whole day most times I change about twice a day ones that I have like my office and dining room are two warmers in the same room because it's a double room so that I feel like those I need double of because I'm using double the bedroom and living room I typically melt the same scent in because they're right next to each other and they tend to clash um, so it, it just depends. I have a, I have a method to my madness, but nobody seems to understand it. <laughs> um, but I guess as long as I understand it, that's all that matters. So anyways, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I will talk to y'all later. Have a great day. Bye.